All right, here's West Wing Season 4, Episode 17, Red Haven's on Fire. This is Rob Lowe's uh, last episode. I read his book, uh, and it's interesting what he, tell, he talks about West Wing because really Rob Lowe has had an interesting career, but his legacy is unfortunately his being caught on tape with two underage girls in a sex scandal back in the 80s and his role on West Wing and how he was the only character part of the ensemble that kind of leaves in season four and he got his own show afterwards, which canceled after five five episodes where in reading his book he really doesn't didn't never liked where his character was going didn't like that he didn't have a, a love interest in his in, in his uh, character which is interesting about that too is that in his book he never re- re- mentions Richard Shift he never mentions uh, Bradley Whitford which I think that he had some problems with them sometimes saying nothing is is, is very telling at the same time where I think that he Richard Schiff had 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 a romance care uh, a storyline. So did Bradley Bradley Whitford. He's had a few of them where they didn't really know what the Brad Brad Lowe was going. So that's why he left. Which is like, I understand where he's coming from, but I think that Rob Lowe wanted to be the main guy, the main squeeze, and I thought that's what he was getting into with the with the West Wing. And you know, you, the, all you know, history shows that that was a very unwise choice because Rob Lowe wasn't a leading man anymore. But this is what's happening in the episode. It's very. It was a very good last episode with Richard Schiff about them kind of being at the bar. But unfortunately, the behind the scenes, it wasn't really the same. That's my review.